Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a tutorial on this beautiful spring appropriate makeup look with a pop of purple. So let's get straight into it. So I'm going to start off with my bare face as we do and I'm going to prime. This is the Maybelline Baby Skin Primer. I'm just popping this in the center of my face where my pores are a little bit larger and I need extra smoothing. Then I go in with my Chi Chi Super CC Cream. This is an amazing uh, foundation alternative for the warmer weather as it's nice and light and dewy. And then I'm just going in and covering any uneven skin tone, pimples, redness, all that sort of stuff with the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. And I absolutely love this combination because I still get that natural dewy finish and I don't have to cake it all up. But I still get to cover everything and my skin looks flawless, so win-win. I then go in with the Rimmel Wake Me Up Concealer and I just use that to highlight underneath my eyes and the center of my face. I'm now grabbing my Australis Ready Set Go Translucent Powder and I'm just setting my under eye concealer with that. This is my absolute favourite powder to do with. And then I'm going in with the Glam Bronze Eau de Soleil by L'Oreal and this is just a liquid bronzer and I'm using that to warm up my face. This is very similar to the Soleil Tan de Chanel um, but this one is just a little bit more liquidy so you can actually mix it into your foundation and I absolutely love this and the effect it gives. Then I'm grabbing the Essence Sun club bronzer and I'm just popping that over the top just to add a little bit extra bronziness because we want to look nice and sun-kissed um, but we're also setting down that cream. Now I'm filling in my brows with the Brow Bar to Go by Gerard Cosmetics and you see me do this a million times and what is there really to say? I'm just gonna fill them in. Now we're keeping the eyes really simple. I'm grabbing my Kali Bible palette and I'm grabbing these two Morby shades and they are just the matte shades that are going in the crease and I'm literally just with a big fluffy brush by Zoeva, I'm just sweeping that all throughout the crease until I get the desired colour that I'm after. Then I'm grabbing the Chi Chi OMFG palette and I'm grabbing this light lilac-y sort of shade and I'm just running that on my lower lash line and then I'm grabbing the darker one because I wanted it to be a little bit more intense so I'm just packing that darker shade a little bit closer to my lash line. Then I'm grabbing the first lightest highlighter shade from the Kali Bible palette and I'm just sweeping that all across my lid just to give it a little bit of a, like a pop. <laughs> then I'm grabbing this nude eyeliner by Rimmel, lining my waterline and then I'm using this CoverGirl Plumpify mascara on my top and bottom lashes and I've been absolutely loving this mascara lately. It's one of CoverGirl's new ones. Then I just applied some falsies and now on to blush. This is Milani Luminoso, an oldie but a goodie. I haven't reached for this for ages and I absolutely love it. Now I'm going in with the Master Highlight by Maybelline and I'm really just highlighting everywhere because we want to look nice and glowy and fresh and then I'm just grabbing these two shades from the Kali Bible palette again and just intensifying the highlight on the very highest points of my cheekbones, my nose, my cupid's bow and the inner corners as well so that we can look nice and glowy. Now I'm going in with Colourpop's Ultra Satin Lip in the shade Marshmallow. I absolutely love this purple shade. I think it's really edgy and cool tone and it looks awesome with the eyes. But of course you can pair this look with a more wearable nude or a pink or something like that. And then I'm just going over with the Rose Water Mist to set this look and voila we are done. So guys I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Please let me know what other looks you would like to see from me in the future. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. I upload twice a week. And and I'll see all you beautiful people in my next video. Bye!